I'm leaving work now, but I wanted to just show you guys. We're doing a model casting here in LA. And basically we're telling all the girls to meet us here Wednesday at 11 a.m. And you're gonna meet with our team. It's gonna be crazy on Wednesday. I feel like I look crazy. I posted the um, vlog late, but it's fine, it's up. Today was a Monday Monday, and I'm cramping. Oh, I don't have any more minutes on here. But yeah, anyways, I'm just ending work. Um, time change, so it feels a little weird to come outside and the light be out, and it still be light out. That's new. I also started my period, so I just don't have the energy today. I didn't have any energy today to get ready for work, so this was it. A matching set from PLT. Oh, and my blue light glasses. These are from PLT, but I feel like they can. They've been helping with like um, the amount of screen time I have on the computer. So, anyways. It feels good to come home at a time where the light is still out. It feels a little weird, not gonna lie. I had to remove some content on here, but um, I now have 18 minutes. Okay, um, but yeah, I got these glasses from work. These are like the blue light glasses and they've been helping with like, I do a lot of time looking at a screen to a point now where like sometimes I'm even squinting and so I feel like I give cool. My little glasses vibe gives so studious. And then no glasses, glasses. So I got my glasses on and I'm heading home. I'm, my period came on today. I mean, my period came on last night and I felt it happening. You ever have that feeling? You know, you guys, girls know the feeling. Also, I'm still going strong with the tree hut lip butter you gotta just rub it in because if you don't rub it in it'll have that like texture in the white it's gonna sit there so highly recommend rubbing it in if you do get this i will likely repurchase this it's only seven dollars the lineage i love it but she's a cute penny i don't want to pay that Anyways, I'll chat with you guys while I head home. Or should we have a little sound sesh? I feel like last time my little sound sesh was cut short. But let's take the scenic route home today. Yay! Oh, it's dark. Okay. Hmm. I don't really know, guys. I really hope I do not need to get a new camera because I will be kind of irritated but is it doing that because of the blue light glasses or okay I don't want to have you guys sit through very bad quality so I won't hold you for too long um I don't even know why it's doing that though because like I don't know I really think there's something wrong with the sensor because when I took it to and then ugh, the camera I don't know, like, I love the Sony, and, like, I really do, but it just, something is up. I'm driving really fucking slow, and it's because I don't want this to lean over. But you ever feel pressure from the cars behind you? Like, change lanes, bro. Anyways, is p -Vol still over here? Oh my god, is it? It is. I haven't been to p -Vol in so long. Wow. I haven't been to any workouts all year. But I'm gonna get it back, I'm gonna get back going because like my hair not done, so now's the time. Oh, it sucks how dark it is. And I don't even know why it's this dark. Okay. Am I thinking it's dark, but it's not? It looks dark. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but I'm heading home. Okay, I think it's a little bit better now. I don't know, guys. Whatever the point is, I'm going home. 
I'm not really hungry. I had my lunch. I had my leftovers from last night for lunch today, um, which was really good. I'm trying to figure out where I can order that Perry Perry, the Nando's lemon and herb sauce because it makes it makes it's a game changer on the chicken. So yeah, I don't know where I'm gonna find it, but I'm gonna figure it out. But anyways, I had that, so I'm still full. And sometimes on my cycle, I'm either really, really hungry or I'm really, I just have zero appetite. When I have the zero appetite, it's terrible because like my stomach has nothing and I'm taking my 800 milligram pills. I know it's terrible, but I'm taking them and fighting for my life. But yeah, tomorrow's day two, and day two is where, huh. So starting tonight, I'm gonna take a pill and do what I need to do there and um, start the journey. And then by Friday, I should be free. I'll be a new woman. Is it just me or after a period, do you guys like shed, like it just feels like I shed and I got new skin, new vibes. Like Friday, I wanna get my hair done. That's it. I want to get my hair done. I want to feel the vibes. I just feel like I can't. I got to do that to really get the vibes going for me. But yeah, anyways, I'm going to go. I don't want you guys to deal with this terrible lighting um, that's going on here. So I'll talk to you guys later. I'm heading home. I'm not going to do much. I'm literally going to drive home and do nothing. So yeah. Oh, I'm going to go home and finish doing laundry. And then, um, what else am I going to do? I'm going to watch some vlogs and finish working. I'm going to finish working at home. Um, I have a few things that I really need to send out today. So I'm going to do that. I just want to do it from the couch. Like, it's time for me to go home. It's 7. And I'll send it from there. And then, um, yeah. I think for, I mean, in regarding to this off, I think 
my only questions well i kind of want to preface so attended fully to take that picture in jamaica but i actually got scammed while i was there so i like left all the girls all the influencer girls it was crazy um so yeah two and probably take something around like because i'm kind of new york city based around like soho um in case this would happen i chose like some cool colder fits or like springy type of outfits that are yeah. more athleisure just because i think ideally i like fall or <laughs> summer okay cool let me go back to them most of the time for the things like this with the packs they're they run really quickly so it shouldn't take a lot of time the tail end of the second week our creative and social team finalized the imagery and then like by the third week it was live so it moves really really quick and then yeah, yeah. for the post so are you saying that you're gonna have the post live um this week or is it something that's gonna go live next week just because the team so needs a I'm, date definitely it's gonna be this week um i just was gonna like take my vacation hair out and like you know. okay cool um if you guys can just share <clears throat> what the exact date is that was just a quick glimpse of a call that i have um i'm having another call with this like thing that po popped up on my instagram feed i'm gonna get on another call with her so far my cramps are doing they're doing okay so uh yeah i'm always like should i keep the camera on hello hi cat how are you hi i'm good i have another person from my team joining the call i don't know okay uh where are you located at i'm in la what about you i'm also in la okay cute um, is the Pretty Little Thing located out of LA or are you uh, remote? Yeah, so the brand is based in the UK um, and we have mm -hmm. offices all over. We have an office in LA, we have one in Miami, we have one in London, and we also have one in Paris. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where we are. I don't have on anything special, just <sighs> glad I'm gonna make it out. Um, I'm meeting with um, my gals, uh, Alyssa Seagal and Vanessa, and we are going to try this one. Guys, this is almost done. I got this, every time I spray this, I have a memory. <laughs> wow. It takes me somewhere. Anyways, love is blind. I don't know. It's a lot, babes. You told me I could trust you Don't die I could really use you Everybody need love, even niggas like me You tell me you ain't shit You told me I could trust you And I could really use you So much I wanna talk about But I ain't got no one to talk to I'm always trying to work it out But somehow it always falls through And I know that I get rough But I just want to feel Guys, I'm on episode 11 of Love is Blind And... Talk about your little white tank top Oh yeah, back and clear I have thoughts That's what I'm saying Does he even have a Okay there, I'm getting, I'm about to leave for work. Okay, Google, what time is it? I need to leave now. It's 8.23 a.m. Okay, yeah, I have to go. Um, I have to be, I'm speaking on a little panel for work today, so this is the look that we're gonna go with. Wait for a little curly vibe. Let's make sure the edges are slab adapted laid okay that'll be more than enough and voila i have on this like pantsuit vest vibe it's really cute um i don't know if you can see but it's long i'm gonna wear my platforms i thought about wearing some heels but oh my hair smells like the place we went to last night. 
I just feel like so much has happened on the show. Like, I don't look too bad. I really thought about taking these braids out last night and this here, honey. But yeah, I feel like I, I have a lot of thoughts. I have a lot of thoughts, a lot of feelings. One thing for sure, Chelsea, Chelsea literally gets on my nerves. Like the constant validation and then the whining voice. And you don't tell me I'm pretty and like, get in the brain. Like girl, give me a break. Like even me, like if I had a friend and I constantly had to tell her like, you know, I really think you're, you're really important in my life. And like, or even a guy, cause I don't think I like that about Clay. Cause I don't like that Clay kept saying like, oh, he kept saying like, you know, you validate me, you validate me. It's like, what validation are you looking for? Like, what do you mean you validate me? Like, what are we talking about here at the, <laughs> right now? Like, are we okay? Are we good here? Like, I don't know. I feel like I look so profesh. Okay, that part is done. I just need to figure out the shoes part and I'm ready to go. I think I see some shoes here that I've yet to move out of the way that I might just wear. Let's see. Okay, I can't really talk. Okay, I guess we'll talk in the car, but happy Wednesday. <laughs> Cute.
camera seems to be it fail it literally dropped on the floor and fail and I think it's back to normal I hope so is it look at how the Sun hits my eyes it's the end of the day the model casting thing was cool today it was fun for the gals I think it was a unique experience Anyways, I'm gonna get myself uh, maybe like 30 more minutes here and then go home and get myself ready for Love is Blind. I'll save my battery and we'll chat later.
I swear it only comes on when I'm about to talk the point I'm making is what I'm saying is good morning I wanted to talk oh it's so dark I don't do you guys see what I'm seeing like it's so you could bear you can't even see me I, hello it's me I don't know why it's dark like this because the light is on so well just coming on here wow I literally <laughs> I literally squished the hell okay that's not a really good look anyways I think I'm gonna wear this bag my little LV I think fragrance we're gonna do gentle fluidity um, happy Friday. Have a date today. Let's see how it goes. I'm doing my part. Do you guys see that? I was not playing. Yeah, I'm already a little late, which I think is fine. Oh, I think I need to change my earrings or something a little bit more. Okay. I will talk to you guys maybe tomorrow morning, but happy Friday. Welcome to my disaster. Welcome back to the vlog. Happy Saturday. I don't know if this is starting a new vlog, end of a vlog. I do not know. But um, I'm sure with the clips that you just saw, you're probably wondering why did she get boxes? I'm moving. <laughs> you guys have heard a little bit of the saga about what's been going on with this new place and everything so the day i told you guys a long story about me sending that passionate that email and everything they actually emailed me back saying she the lady emailed me back basically saying yes it's approved you have 60 day notice so since then you know i started like this whole looking for a new apartment thing and it's been a little passionate um, I saw, I didn't see too many places because honestly, I really wanted to avoid the idea of like, but maybe there's another one, but maybe there's something even better, but maybe there may be something even better. I just didn't want to overwhelm myself with like mad places and then come to a place of like, I can't make a decision. So, um, but yeah, so for the time being, I have found something and it is 
I think it's aligned and it's aligned the next two weeks I will be leaving because that 60 day mark has come now and um, there's a lot that I need to like pack back up um, it's a little crazy because it's been six months since I've been here and already like I'm leaving and part of me is just like am I doing the right thing like you know but I think yes now I think I know so one thing that I can say that I notice immediately right now as of right now like I don't have a lot of anxiety um, with this so that's good I don't have as much anxiety as I did with the last like when I was selecting this place and so yeah so let me know if you guys even want to see before I even say that I'm gonna check and see like did I record enough footage to like do like a looking for an apartment in LA and I can include some of the ones that I looked at previously before I moved in six months ago but I don't know if that would be relevant um, but yeah so I am moving and within the next two weeks I'm gonna be doing that now I don't think I don't I've never done like a moving vlog series as much as I think like I love watching those type of videos I personally just don't like doing them because they just feel like a lot you know they feel like a lot and also I just I just don't really want to do that you know what I mean I feel like I just want to show up to where I'm at and you guys are there too and you can see like oh, okay so she moved you know so I feel like I'll let you know that I've moved but I don't know if I'd be able to like take you through the whole thing and if I do it might best just be one little like a couple of videos or b-roll of it happening but I don't know if I'll do like an entire segment you know um, I tried doing that with the last move but then things happened and so here we are now um, but yeah I don't know I guess I'm gonna gauge it and see how I feel but yeah so I got boxes and I'm gonna start doing some of the packing stuff now and really getting grips on like packing stuff up because I got a lot of clothes a lot of stuff in the closet I just got a lot of stuff and so I gotta get it together but yeah that's an update I was like I need to tell you guys I have to tell you guys I don't know how to tell you guys but I need to tell you I was like regardless I have to let you guys know that I'm moving and I need to do it ASAP you know now surprisingly now that I'm like leaving and everything I feel so, what's the word? I feel like I'm gonna miss a few, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I am gonna miss quite a few things here. Um, you know, this, this little day view thing I have here because everything is south facing, but um, the new place is going to have south facing and east facing, which is cool, which is similar to what I have right now, which is the sunrise and obviously daylight all day. Yeah, I'm, that's happening, that's it's moving time, so I have to do this all over again, which is crazy. Um, I hired movers again, because I realized that I really enjoyed the, the convenience of just having someone come pick it up and carry all that stuff upstairs. I was not gonna be able to do that the last time, so I'm doing it now, and yeah. So, my that's one of the reasons why I never unpacked the dressers that I got from um, Amazon that I ordered a while ago and I hope they're okay because it's past 30 days at this point so I'm gonna open them up when I get to the new place so I'm excited you know I feel like I don't want to say I'm excited but I am excited to like go and go to this new place you know I haven't seen the place in a while because when I first saw it I've seen it twice yeah, so anyways, I guess like once I make it there and that happens, like I'll talk a little bit more about it. That's what's happening, that's the latest. I'm moving. But you know what, this place did do what I said I wanted to do. Get started with like posting content and like, cause like the light in here has been amazing. So like I've been able to post all of my reels and my TikToks and stuff because I just get dressed every day and like it helps me do that. Anyways, I'm gonna watch a little bit of YouTube and i'm sure you guys see some of the boxes it's a mess in here i got a package from forever 21 last night i wore um i think i told you guys i went on a date it was cool um <clears throat> it was cool um i wore this 
skirt that I got from Forever 21. I got a whole package from Forever 21 that I have to do some posting for. Um, and it's all free. So like, I'm not getting paid to do it. It's just, I'm gonna do some reels and TikToks. But this cargo skirt, how cute is that? It was so cute. I didn't take any pictures in it, but I did get it a little big. I got it in a 4X. I definitely could have got away with a 3X, but I just didn't know. I didn't know what I was gonna get myself into. It's been a minute since I shopped at Forever 21, so yeah. And then this outfit that I have on is from PLT's um, Sport Sculpts select ca um, a collection, and guys, I love it. I think I showed you guys. This is so good. I highly, I recommend it. Yes, it's good. So yeah, anyways, I finally let you guys know that's what's happening, finally. I'm so grateful that it's happening and you know i just want to take my time and like you know make sure i'm all good to go but yeah it's happening i'm moving <laughs>